everybody ninja nick here with 420 gamer tv and this is going to be a review video now i've been on the hunt for an external hard drive for my ps4 for a very long time and i mean one that you know i wouldn't have to pre-program you know put the program into the device and into you know my playstation or via you know vice versa and then be able to use it <laughs> I found this really interesting one just recently in GameStop, and I actually have looked it up and found out that you can get it in other locations as well, such as Best Buy and or um, Amazon. You can actually get it on Amazon as well. But uh, what it is, right, it is called the WD Elements, all right? That's what it looks like. Literally what it is right there. You know what I mean? It, I got the four trillobyte one. Now... I got mine at GameStop because I was in GameStop and I was doing trade-ins and everything. And I saw I saw uh, I was actually having a conversation with why I was doing the uh, doing some of the trade-ins because I wasn't playing some of the games and you know I just couldn't I didn't have space on my PlayStation. So uh, that she actually was telling me how they had this external hard drive for PlayStation, but it actually works for other systems as well. So if you wanted to use this on your Xbox, you can use it on your Xbox. Just plug it in. Like, literally, this is all I had to do was I plugged it in. It uh, popped up as external hard drive. You click into that. What it, what it will do is then it will start, uh, bam, all good and done. Yeah, I literally had it configured in, like, pretty much three or four seconds. And then as soon as it's been done, I have all my stuff. Everything that I, that I wasn't able to fit on my PlayStation is on there now. So, it was awesome. And... The, the price that it was uh, at, this, at at GameStop, it varies where you get it, but at GameStop, it was $130. But because I did trade-ins and I had coupons, I got it for about 30 bucks. So I got a, a four trillibyte hard drive for my PlayStation for about $30. It was pretty awesome. <laughs> it was way worth it. I mean, way worth it. I'm fucking stoked. 30 bucks for a four trillibyte, uh, you know, hard drive. That's pretty awesome. But you can get it on Amazon. For Amazon, I think it was about a hundred and twenty something dollars, but that you know, add shipping and handling. But it is over a hundred dollars, and if you're Amazon Prime, you know, you get free shipping. So hey, there you go. Um, you can get it at Best Buy, but I don't know if you can actually get this exact one at Best Buy. Cause I checked the website, and it doesn't it doesn't look like the exact one. They have WD Elements there, but uh, yeah, and it works great. It's, it's awesome. It works wonderful. I, I haven't had to, uh, like, you, you, you have to sacrifice a USB port on your PlayStation, and, you know, that's not that bad. But, yeah, I mean, rocks. Definitely was worth it. Definitely, definitely was worth it. But, that's it for this video, guys. I just wanted to do a quick little review of the WD Elements, which is, I would say, the one of the best hard drives externally for a system because I, I didn't have to take anything apart and everything else it was just simple uh, plug it in like literally plug it into the wall because it has a power outlet plug it into the playstation's usb and then just hit configure and like, i literally just hit that a couple times boop, 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 about three times i think and it was completely done and i i was able to put all my stuff on there so i was pretty stoked about it but I hope you guys enjoyed the video, you know, I hope it's very helpful when it comes to you getting one. There is other ones other than just the 4 trillobyte. they have a 1, 2, 3, and 4. I'm pretty sure they probably have more, but 4 is good enough for me because that's a lot. But I hope you all have a great day, a great night, a great evening, all that great shit. You know exactly what I mean. Catch me for my next one. Later, guys.